know what I mean? But um, I'm, I'm, I'm permanently mm-hmm. based in Johannesburg. Mm-hmm. So if, if you're going to land in, if you find yourself landing, mm-hmm. landing in Johannesburg, mm-hmm. the great places to go to is Soweto. I don't know if you've heard I've of seen Soweto. The movie. I've seen the movie. Soweto. <laughs> yeah, so Soweto is a, is a, is a big township in, in Johannesburg. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's where, that's where um, you know, all the great stuff is happening. You know, there's a lot of tourist attractions there. And, you know, it's just a great vibe. You know, I think if you land in South Africa, that's one of the good places that you can actually go to, you know, and see, um, you know, and learn much about South Africa, you know. I was so I was. added to my bucket list. But I'm really glad you use that word vibe because um, yesterday we were we had a topic and we're asking our fans, what does the word vibe mean to you? If you hear vibe, what's the first thing that you feel? Like, what the definition of vibe according to you, what is it? You know, vibe is like, you know, when you when you um, uh, see something for the first time mm-hmm. and, you know, mm-hmm. you really feel it within you, mm-hmm. you know, or maybe mm-hmm. you listen to something for the first time and, you know, you feel it in your soul, you know, like gives you a good vibe, you know, it makes you feel good. Mm-hmm. That's mm-hmm. my definition. It's, it's yeah. all the way in the soul. In the soul, guys. In the soul. You, you're you, a Gemini. You, you were born on 24th June. I was born on the 18th. Yes, that's why we're friends. Yeah. No, you're not. Wait, are you? Really? Where does Gemini end? Ah, there was assuming. Uh uh. Nimetroma, guys. Nimetroma, guys. Hashtag is so fun. Hashtag is so fun. Yes. I'm just by the end of, of you know, Ken. Uh huh. Uh huh. To do something for me because I. I I've interviewed a couple of dance hall artists and that when they're talking, when they speak, they're very, you know, low key and, and chill. But when they start singing, I don't know where the bass comes from. Is that something you can do for me right now? Like just out of the blue, just do something maybe from a song of yours. And give me some life. Give me umph. All right, listen this. She mm-hmm. says she wants a real man. Cause she's African queen, she say that she want a winner. Say she want a real man. Cause she's African queen, she say that she a want a winner. Say she want a real man. Cause she's African queen, she say that she want a winner. Say she want a real man. Cause she's African queen. Oh. Yes, she's African. Hey, my girl, well if a style and a pattern you have it all. Free speak and manners you have it all. Uh. Cause you a wife material. You not say look, look, or you not typical na bada worry na natal the two a week would a in a merry tal ring pan your finger girl cause me no say you na dinari yeah man hey that's one of my songs called uh huh uh huh yeah you know what I mean yeah it was me but you you is an African queen you is an African queen Aww. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, so sweet. Oh my gosh. How can we find you on? You make Sorry? me feel like flying ah, down to Kenya. Calm. You, know? you make ah, me feel like calm. Come to Kenya. Come home. Come yeah. to Kenya. It's, it should not Come be your home. home. It should um, not be your yeah, home. This, that's, that's my other home. Hey. <laughs> hey. But, for real though, yes, yes. but for real though, if you ever find yourself in Kenya, let us know. We'll go treat you well. well. Definitely. Mm. Definitely. You're making such good music. Show it's even it's made even it to made. places like Channel O. How was that? How did that feel? That must have been a milestone. Yeah, that, that feels good, you know. It feels good to be endorsed by big uh, TV stations like Channel O. Mm-hmm. It feels good to be endorsed by big channels like, you know, your channel, the Social hey. Fridays, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, it's good to it's good to go on the ground and shoot a music video and you know it ends up playing on big stations you do a song in studio and plays on radio you know it's it's, it's a good feeling for an artist you know and uh, we give thanks for for the people that you know are behind the scenes and you know trying to make sure that the the, the, the music reaches uh, the people you know what i mean mm-hmm. 
Yeah, man. All right, so question for the day as Social Friday, by the way, if you're watching at home, please understand we do have a question and we put it up on our socials. So at White Five on Facebook, White Five Four channel on Twitter, hashtag is Social Friday. We are asking you who is the most controversial celebrity in Kenya, someone that you love to hate. So uh, translating it for Yazo, I'm going to ask him who is the most controversial celebrity in South Africa that people just love to hate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like right now is the lockdown and thing, you know. So it's it's actually, you know, a difficult one because, you know, there's not much drama in the street and, you know, the music in the streets has been quiet. People are doing their things on social media and mm -hmm. all, you know. Um, but what, one thing I would like to say is that there's a lot of great artists around here, you know. Um, mm -hmm. Some of them do good, some of them do bad sometimes, you know, but yeah. Even though they do some good, you know, they'll always get back. Even even though they do some bad, they will always get back to their good, to their good uh, behavior. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> That's a very diplomatic answer. That was very politically correct. I see you. I see you in yeah. English. <laughs> yeah. <man. laughs> All right. Tell us what is new. What 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 are you releasing? What are you gonna give us today? Um, yeah, um, I, I've just recently dropped my album, which is a 13-track album called Dirty Wine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's um, it's doing very well right now, you know. Um, it's playing on a couple of radio stations, and uh, we're busy uh, promoting it mm -hmm. all over all over Africa and all mm -hmm. over the world. You know, it's it's been it's been playlisted in one of the biggest stations in Ghana called um, Hits FM. Um, it's been playing in, in mm -hmm. Uganda, it's, it's, it's playing in Kenya. Yeah, so I'm busy shooting music videos, you know what I mean? So yeah, there's more content coming up and people can look uh, forward to you know, new content every time, you know. We, can, we are I like we, that. Working. Yeah. I like that very, very much. Because just right. the title has already made me happy. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I can't wait oh my to look down to end. Way, we are going to dance. We are going to dance this with yeah. our songs. So. <laughs> yeah. I have just one more question, maybe, perhaps. I, I'm, I'm a little bit ignorant. I'm sorry. My name is Shamba. But it's my understanding 17 tracks on an EP is a lot. <laughs> How? How did you have 17 tracks on one EP? Like how even? The, the intro EP was actually mm -hmm. like my second project. And mm -hmm. uh, at that time I released my first project called Current Affairs. Mm -hmm. um, and then between Current Affairs and the intro, I had a lot of songs. I was doing a lot of songs, you know, and um, I realized that I'm about to drop an album, so it's best for me to, you know, just to drop all of those tracks on that one EP, mm -hmm. so that people can get, you know, a feel of uh, the different uh, type of vibes that I bring, you know, in a in a song. So that that uh, the intro EP is a 17 track mm -hmm. um, EP, which which has songs that speak, you know, about every every other thing. You know what I mean? It's featuring great artists like Swazi K. Mm -hmm. It's featuring a, a, a band pot, you know. Mm. Yeah, so that's how it came about. You know, I was I just wanted to release all the songs that I had that I had and uh, you know just concentrate on my next project which was my that one album yeah. All right. I'm about to catch a feeling because from South what? Africa all the way to Ghana. Okay, so and you've not Kenya. had a Kenyan on your beat. Should I catch a feeling? You know what, that's mm. something that I've really, mm. really, really been worried about. You know, it's something that I really want to to try and and uh, do on my next project, you know what I mean? Um I probably need to to do a little bit of research and find out, you know, who 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 I, who I can collaborate mm -hmm. with. Uh, obviously, I'll have to sit down with my manager. You know, we have to come uh, to come to an agreement with mm -hmm. that. Unless if you have someone that uh, you can suggest, uh, you know, I know uh, people. Maybe we can get to that. I know people. people. In the, yeah. So, we're going to have another private Zoom meeting. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. We can't tell you everything all at once. Cindy, yes. Yeah, I got you. Yes. Yes. That would be nice. That would be nice. Where can we find Where you on social media? On social media. Oh, on social media, I'm on Facebook. Um, um, my page is Yazo, J A H Z O. Mm -hmm. And um, on Instagram, mm -hmm. um, I'm Yazo Music. 
-hmm. We also have a website, www.rootboyent.com. Yeah, that's where all, all our information is at. Yeah. Okay. All right. Do you have something you'd like to tell your Kenyan fan base? Because now you've already opened a gate <laughs> into Kenya in particular, maybe. Okay, I don't want to say Nairobi, but people watch us all the way from Nivasha, West Ngishu. So basically, you have the nation's attention. So what would you like to tell us? Yeah, man, I would just like to pass the message to all the people there to say that people must, um, you know, keep safe, stay home, you know sanitize because COVID-19 thing is real, you know, mm -hmm. um, the social distance, um, stay home and be safe, you know what I mean? Because tomorrow mm -hmm. is, is going to be a brighter day. You have to be there to witness Yazo on stage when he comes through. Hey. It, um, yeah, man. You see that? You're talking oh, nice big things. Up, big up nice us, thing. All the viewers, them. <laughs> okay, okay. So what we're going to do is you're going to sing for me the last time because I enjoy hearing you perform, even if it's this minute. So you're going to sing a little bit or do your thing. And then we're going to play your song from over here. And I'd like you to bump to it so that we can, you know, kind of fix you in the video. Or something. Right. Okay. All right. So wait, wait, wait. I thought that on Facebook, white people channel to the hashtag is social Friday. Please don't go away. Yaz is about to bless us once more with his voice. And then we'll be right back for some more. I right, go. Yo, me come from a place where he's near Vinda. Good vegetation and a beautiful weather. One nation, people live together. Cut. Yeah, yeah, man. That song is called you know um where me come from you know it um where me come from is a place called venda and it's in the northern side of south africa you know um yeah man it's a song that just talks about um you know the place where i come from mm -hmm. you know and other them things them you know people can can get it on uh on the socials mm -hmm. it's there right now oh, you know what i mean right. yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, man. now let yeah. us bless you with the other song from over here guys Mm -hmm. Hashtag for Social Friday. 